Hey guys, welcome to the Merseyside Derby. This is uh, becoming a very interesting title race indeed. It is Everton versus Liverpool, and the reason I say that is because if we look at the uh, Premier League fixtures here, uh, Man United played Arsenal and they actually uh, lost. They lost 2-1. Uh, Dan Fletcher scored, but Walcott and AU with the goals for Arsenal. Um, so if we look at this here, admittedly they will have, again, two games in hand over us. Uh, but we can temporarily, temporarily go uh, level on points with Man United. I don't think it will mean much, but uh, we can go temporarily level. Um, yeah, it's more of a psychological thing, I suppose. Um, anyway, our team here, going back to the regular 4-4-2. Um, everyone's back in 100% pretty much. Uh, Enrique, Aguilar, Carragher, Johnson. I think this is probably my big. This is probably, with the exception of Maxi. Uh, probably instead of him with Gerrard, who's on the bench now. Uh, he's finally recovered from his injury. Um, I, th I think that's probably my strongest team. Uh, so let's uh, waste no more time. Um, let's get to it then. Is this is a massive game then. If it has to be. I'd usually usually go, oh, the fans, it's boring me now. But it's a derby, so I think that's the natural thing. That's the natural way to go, I would assume, for anyone. Right, 10 seconds in. And there uh, we get to have a touch of the ball. Well, that's not necessarily a bad thing. <laughs> it's Drente, of course, who... Um, on my Southampton save, Liverpool actually signed, which is uh, interesting. I just remembered. Um, I was very confused by it, and then um, I thought, why has that happened? And uh, apparently, he, uh, he's, he he has some relations with Liverpool. I don't know why. I, I don't know. I, I don't know if he supports Liverpool or something. I, that could have been. That could be complete falsification. But that's what I heard. Anyway, um, well, I don't think that's the case. If he went to Everton, clearly, <laughs> I don't know where that happened. But yeah, I think someone's got that got themselves wrong there. Anyway, um, we're going to move on to control. We uh, may remember we won the last derby 3 0. Luis Suarez got a hat trick. Um, so it, as, it wasn't as uh, easy as the scoreline may suggest. You know, we uh, it was a it was a difficult game, but Suarez proved just to be the, the difference, and he's just been robbed by Tony Hibbert, who he <laughs> lashes out at. I suppose he trips him over. There's still that thing of Stever Tony, and you know, if Tony Hibbert scores. It's going to be, a, especially at the Gladys Street end, uh, you know, the far right to us now, uh, Goodison Park. Uh, it, you know, there'd be a big, uh, apparently there's going to be a big pile on. <laughs> Everyone's just going to jump on top of each other <laughs> and he scores, which I find, because he's never scored for Everton. I hope I don't jinx anything. Look at this, passing, good God almighty! What the fuck is going on here? Oh, Suarez again. <laughs> Takes out Hibbert again. Um, yeah, I know Everton aren't, like, known for the passing, but Come on, <laughs> yeah. Um, there's four four two. I swear to God, I thought I might go back to four four two, but if, I, I just had an inkling that maybe I might as well here. But uh, clearly not the case at the moment. It's all all Everton. Look, why is why? Okay, on what planet has Tony Hibbert got the better of Luis Suarez? I'm just I'm just saying. I know Evertonians might say, yeah, Hibbert's a beast, but why are we committing so many fouls? Is that we have any? And pushing has nothing to do with hard tackling, by the way. Before you say hard tackling anyone, um, pushing doesn't. That, that's a hard tackling. That's put. That's actually just pushing. <laughs> you know. So um, yeah. They, oh, they need to stop this long ball shit. Here we go. Now Suarez, don't run hit towards hit. He'll tackle you. Doesn't matter. Come on. How is that a fucking gold kick? Phil Neville clearly got the last touch. This. I don't like that long ball. We kind of, we kind of got lucky with that last long ball there. But um, I'd rather them play like this, rather on the floor, not keep, you know, don't blast the ball off like that. As far as again, getting kind of lucky, should have scored again there. As far as getting lucky with these balls, that could easily have been intercepted by an Everton player. And uh, we are getting near to half time, but we have grown in the game, I suppose. Now getting possession back, Everton have had there. 20 minutes or so, I suppose this is our 20 minutes, coming to an end hopefully, not, oh, hang on, oh, again, it, it just, it's just this in too much intricate, too much intrication at the moment, it's passing, I don't know, where the hell is, no, I, I've actually read Donovan actually, I've talked about this before, I think someone highlighted, was talking about, about Donovan, how maybe he was too good for Everton or whatever, where's Carroll, how did that not go in, wow, that was, that, you can't get closer than that, unless you hit the post obviously, Wow. Wow then. There you go. At least Rain actually has the sensibility to uh, keep it on the floor. Oh, come on. Ross Barkley. Good God. He's, he must be really 
got on this as like you know a youngster. Don't give him much space. Carragher's too slow. Uh, I think Carragher's probably. I might stab. Oh, I don't know. Carragher's too slow. They're far too slow. He would. That would. That, that would real life. He'd be alert to Tim Cahill so quickly. That was so wrong. Phil Neville's offside. I'm getting annoyed here because they're having way too many chances. We're not have. We're not creating enough. For sure. I mean, yeah. To be honest, yeah. It's it's a crap match. Suarez nervous. Fuck off, nervous. Play a natural game. No reaction. You want him to be relaxed. Oh, that's annoying. Why is Lucas nervous? I'm, I'm hesitant to say it's a midfield player, but since he has been caught numerous times today, um, I am gonna risk it. Oh, and he should be in Luis Suarez, but at the same time, must have been a fight. Very two very feisty players there. Uh, Victor needs to be surprisingly. Good on this, considering you know how uh, how many times he's actually scored for Everton. <laughs> Here's Ross Barkley. He does look good, Ross Barkley. I'm not gonna not gonna mess around. He does look good. Um, looks like a good player. Whether he obviously could create a good future partnership with him and Rodwell in midfield, I don't know. Yeah, we're gonna have to change things up. This isn't good enough. We're on the back foot far too often. I think it's the four four two. I think the teams have finally got us sussed. So I need to show the state of the uh, asymmetrical formation. Suarez is going to shoot here. No. Fuck off this, Dan. <laughs> For this game, my arse. Oh, Carol. Uh, sorry, Cal, beg your pardon. I, I, I'm getting... Well, one thing I'm noticing, I'm getting kind of... It's kind of irritating me now. And it, not just in the Liverpool game, in the Southampton game as well. The amount of times... Where, look at this! Why can it shut up with the... Ex-player is furious at the ref. He wants a penalty. I'm, I'm getting really annoyed at how many times this... I don't know if this if this has happened for you as well, but how many times has that happened in a season? It's happening far too often for me, and it's really starting to annoy me. I know players moan and bitch about having, how not having penalties and all that, but for, even then, compared to real life, it's still way too often. Oh, Tony Hibbert. Oh, no, I thought it might have been a penalty, but no, uh, it, was, it was a ball in, but Cal put it in. But Tony Hibbert thought about the foul there on, uh, I think it was Johnson. Here we go, we've got a chance again here with Enrique, but no, nothing. Uh, Lucas might have, I think someone's going to open up for a shot, and it's going to blaze over any moment now, I can feel it. Look, see, he still won a penalty! I mean, okay, look, it's that, it's, that's happened three times. In the moments that I've been talking about, it's happened three times, see what I mean? It could, it, the game's backing me point up here. I think it's happening too many times. Either give the fucking penalties, or just don't mention it, because it's starting to really irritate me now. <laughs> the amount of Occasions where this happens. I think I'm going to make a substitute now. Uh, once we've seen this highlight, yeah, that's a shit ball. Yeah, that was poor. Um, who's having a bad game then? Suarez. Oh, yeah, he's, he's annoying me. Um, I might bring Tony on actually. Two target man. Probably ain't going to work, but. Don't have to bring on as well. I might take Maxi off as well for Bellamy. Um. Di Maria can't play in the middle, can he? Uh, Cal can play in the middle. No, he can't. Oh, yeah. Tell you what, then I'm going to have do this. <laughs> Excuse me. Try that. And look at Tony, I want to say, um, this is what you've got, I want to see a good display. Let's see what happens. Need to get a bit of. Just a little bit extra, you know, it's that little bit. <laughs> Excuse me. It's still got a terrible cold. I think about ionitis or something. I don't know. Nose keep re keeps reacting to random shit. I know. Here we go. Di Maria with a corner. Not the best corner in the world. Oh, thought that was gonna sneak in for a second and just you know, and the ball goes it goes towards the goal. And you just think, hang on, I wasn't expecting that. Ross Barkley's gone off anyway. So yeah, so it's been a fairly even game, but it's still. Gotta win, gotta get the win here, man. You know, he said slipped up against Arsenal again. It's that Southampton. What I talked about with the Southampton save, they they slip up, we slip up. Oh, and Carroll, that was a sort of cross come shot there from Carroll. Tony nearly got it at the end of it. Whether he was offside, I don't know. Make another time enough to bring Gerard on then for um, Lucas. I have to go for it. Um, and then we'll have Aga. I think Carragher can play, actually. Can Carragher play, though? He can, can't he? No, he can't. We'll have Aga, because he's more attacking. Uh, advanced playmaker, attack. 
I think we might change Carol to sort of. Uh, I know he, he obviously is best as a target man, but I'm gonna. Sorry, Tony. As a, sorry, Tony. As a deep lying forwards, um, just want to see how this works. I need to change things up. I don't think it'll do anything because it never does. Excuse me. Look at Tony's injured. That's that's just great. Uh, he's eighty two percent. I'll keep him on. Never mind. Ah, uh, don't give the ball away. Tim, Tim Cahill, by the way, is being not considered for Player of the Year, which confused me considerably because um, I, I, I don't know what he's why why he's warranted for that. Anyway, Gerard needs the match fitness, so I don't think he'll be at his top best. And again, really poor header, chance to win, and uh, that's really just summed everything up today. Been a really bad performance from both teams, to be honest. Rubbish game, rubbish game. Um, should be it. Yeah, that's that was a rubbish game. Rubbish. Rubbish. Um. So calmly, not pleased. And Suarez calmly as well, not pleased. Uh, who else sucked? No one else actually. No one else. It was just them two that kind of let us down today. Um. But yeah, I think that's. I think we're never gonna we're gonna win the title in the position we were in. But a disappointing nil nil. Uh, look at Tony. Let's give him an injection. There's nothing else. To, not as well. I'll do the post match conference then since it's a derby game. Watch our team of penalty. Um. I think I'll say the referee got it wrong. It'll probably have it, the FA will discipline me because it's really funny. <laughs> I like it. The referee, I love how the FA discipline. It nothing happens. Like they just discipline you, or they they warn you. I think. Uh, yeah, yeah, whatever. And look, see, player of the year. Why the hell is Tim Kale in there? I'd give it to RVP, even though he doesn't deserve it. <laughs> just see, job won by FA. <laughs> I can't do anything with it. Uh, so yeah, Man United, I don't know if they're going to play. I'll just continue it just to see if they do play. See, we can see the less goals than them. We've got three games then. Um, Arsenal, I think out of this four, if we got nine points, I'd be happy. So we've got four at the moment. Or nine, I think, at the absolute most. I think at the minimum, six. So if we get two draws, I wouldn't be too bothered. But yeah, I think the title is out of our reach now. Man United have just been far too good. They could very well end up with 100. Can they? I just think. Yeah, they could easily still end up with at least um, five. Hang on, what's five times six? Thirty-five. Yeah, they could easily end up with uh, hundred points here. I mean, they've still got five games left. We've got three. So anyway, uh, disappointing nil-nil draw. But to be honest, it was a bit of a crap game. Let's be honest. <laughs> they didn't really offer much. We didn't really offer much. I'm going to have to go back to the asymmetrical formation. It seems for the Arsenal game, we're doing very poorly, as you can see, in sixth place in the Premier League. So I'll get the team ready for that, and I'll see you for that one then. Goodbye for now.